as mentioned from the previous video, I'll be doing Miss Cambodia 2022, the one that will be representing Cambodia to Miss Universe. Her name is Manita Han, and she's currently here in the Philippines to train, and there will be a separate video for that, so watch out. So let's go and see her performance on her national budget. She looked like a uh, Megan Young. And you see that from by how many times? No five. Wow, she is glowing. Last but not least for this segment, best in production number award. Congratulations, MUC. So, my was at the MUC, not from by Manita. Wow, she's so beautiful. I'd say, and best in production number. First time I heard that award in a national pageant. Um, I think I missed the swimwear. There is no swimwear competition in this video. Okay. I just didn't like the shoes, but um, yeah, I didn't like the shoes. But she's serving it well, so I think it's good. Pretty much, I know. She has the basic. It's just that uh, I feel like there's, you know, uh, an opportunity for her to walk slow, bring more elegance to the lockdown portion, because that's what it's for. And how will it affect your life in the future? Thank you for the question. Miss Universe Cambodia this year has taught me the value of sisterhood. Miss Universe pageant is a platform that brings races and people from different backgrounds together. We are sisters by purpose. We joined Miss Universe Cambodia with the same goal, but we became sisters. And our bond is eternal. Beyond this coronation night, we will still be friends. We will still be together, support each other towards our goal. Thank you. What was the question? Affects your life in the future. Allow me to repeat. In this month long lessons. We're looking at lessons. What lessons have you learned and how will it affect your life in the future? Thank you for the question. Miss Universe Cambodia this year has taught me the value of sisterhood. Miss Universe pageant is a platform that brings races and people from different backgrounds together. We are sisters by purpose. We joined Miss Universe Cambodia with the same goal, but we became sisters. And our bond is eternal. Beyond this coronation night, we will still be friends. We will still be together, support each other towards our goal. Thank you. I was kind of lost. Like, I thought the question was like, what is the lesson which you've learned from this month long pageant? She didn't answer the question, but the way that she answered her answer to that question was very calm, very like somehow emotional, but also not. Um, yeah, I, I would have wished that the, she answered the question. Uh, that would be like the end goal of it all. Like, I think she has like this great potential. She's really pretty. She looks like Megan Young of the Philippines, the Miss World, the only Miss World as of now uh, that came from Philippines. So, yeah, I was expecting her to answer the question, you know, but 
the message that she said there was also amazing like the bond the sisterhood that you know pageants bring but i don't think that is a learning you know but i would guess that's what she learned i don't know it's it's on how she phrased it i feel like there's an opportunity to answer really quickly and to the point congratulations hong manita for making it to top five but you are beautiful stop jump down thank you beyond beautiful miss universe cambodia is beyond beautiful beauty that is immeasurable on this stage miss universe cambodia promotes our country elevates it for for the international stage to see that cambodia can do it we have much more than just angkor wat we have a rich heritage culture and our beautiful people as well thank you she's really nervous you can tell but i think it's a good answer cambodia can do it we have much more than just angkor wat we have a rich heritage culture and our beautiful people as well thank you she basically described cambodia you know i think it's just boils down to like the word play that she's gonna use um in, in miss universe these um techniques of answering might get you just let's say fourth third runner up um but also i didn't see like the swimmer competition so i, I cannot really like say if she has a chance to like at least be in the semifinals but the way that she speaks it's very um it's very passionate and emotional too i would have wished she could have at least be more strong with her answer be more certain because the answers that she's giving it's not really like what you want to hear and also well she can answer what she wants to answer right but based on the question it's too far from what the question is looking for so at least make it strong and sound right um i can feel hesitations so yeah that might be the issue so i think all of like the miss universe candidates right now are all beautiful so even though i said that she's beautiful it doesn't mean a thing because all of them are right so it's just boils down to how you present yourself and right now the vulnerable side of her really is overtaking her power so i hope with training she'll be able to you know nail it i mean she has this strong aura already you know but it wasn't backed up during this competition and even for her question and answer yeah from my home She's trying to compose herself. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but it, it was really like showing, you know. It, it's it's just she's very um, showy of her of what she feels, and I think that's I don't know how to explain it, but I do think that you know when there's a saying "fake it till you make it," I don't think that she plays that well. <laughs> You can literally see on her face and in uh, her actions about how uncertain she is, how nervous she is. Hopefully, she'll build more confidence because she would need that in the competition. She'll up against Thailand, Philippines, at least in Asia. You, you, you'll, you'll see. Um, I did Nepal as well. Um, she did like, I think she needs a little help in the walking here i didn't see like a walking help but the gracefulness of it all 
like I think it just boils down to how confident she is during the night. So it's her night, but it wasn't her best night for sure. You know, she could do something more. But again, congratulations, Cambodia. You have a new queen, Manita, who's hanging up here in the Philippines. Uh, she's hanging up for her training, and that's good. She's been able to polish more of the things that she needs to do and as of right now she's like uh, undescribable like she needs to come out for shell she might make it but i'm not too sure you know let's see four months out from today so if you like contents like this i'll be doing a lot more there will be a manita video for miss road to miss universe episode 3 video coming up after this. See ya.